so today we are doing another product review today we have a vacuum cleaner we have the power force helix by bissell um bissell is a well-known brand in the vacuum family i guess you can say so i just buy this one yesterday from walmart cash back you understand cash back everything you know if you can do the cash back thing which where i make some video cash back everything you understand you spend a dollar you get something from every dollar you spend why not so anyway today as i said we have a vacuum cleaner um this is what it basically look like outside of the box they have a couple different colors they can choose from and uh, since me a boy and uh, you, know, you know we get the blue one the blue one back on the, yeah so anyway as you can see it's not too it's not too big not too small just right so first thing first um you have down here is the height adjustments so as you can see it's on the beer flow so you can do it on a flat surface in the kitchen where you have tile or anything like that you can just run your vibe and you can basically vacuum the floor and then on the next side you have a high carpet you know from the bougie and you have a thick nice plush carpet you understand and don't mind the dirt because me, um i already try to see how good it work and it work good and as you can see it take up a lot of stuff off of the floor so first thing first you have all a little different attachment pieces are so so i'm going to go ahead and show you how to install this piece and go from there so one thing that doesn't come with this that you're going to need is a screwdriver so you have two little small screws that basically go on the two sides right there and right there and this is the handbar as you can see and the way this goes it basically slides on top like so and then you drop your two screws in and then you use a screwdriver to screw them down so make sure you do that snug tight put on that the other screw over here snug tight so that's the first attachment and then while me here these systems they are um, bagless so that's good so you don't have to keep on buying no bag as you can see all of the dirt and everything gets trapped in this little compartment here which is easily removed by pressing this hold on sorry about that sometimes kind of hard for the with one hand but as you can see it's not too too hard but as you can see you just release this lever to empty you see how that goes up and down it basically releases it out of that groove and then you pull forward so this is the canister that holds all the dirt so as you can see down here this is a local um, kind of a filter area on the base for the dirt and then also down here when you're ready you release this tab you basically press this and this part comes open and you just dump it you have your filter in the top here which we're not going to take apart right now but if you wanted to take it apart you would basically release this clip it up and then it comes off so let's put that back in so just put it down clicks back in place once you hear that click you know it's good solid firm all right good for go so the other attachments that come with this are you look uh, brush if you know you want to get in high places or whatever it may be if you prefer to use this on stairs or anything like that window blinds or anything then you have your another ex um, attachment piece so if you want to get in tight spaces you can hold that up under that and then this piece actually goes on the back of the vacuum 
down here to hold the power cord so what you want to do is find the groove that it fits in let's see maybe that could be hard to see but I'm good. all right so once you have that in you twist it counterclockwise and it goes in to remove it a little bit tight but clockwise and then release look for these tabs push them in make it match up with those two here and here so you push it in you might take a look of force and then counterclockwise and that's in so I do already have the power card plugged into the wall as you can see and you have 23 23 um, feet of card so that should give you a good distance of vacuum and then this is the main line that goes from the, the vacuum floor or wherever you're going to vacu vacuum in the surface it goes from the brushes and it goes all the way up to your tank so what you want to do is look for this groove match it up with this groove and then you basically push it in and you rotate this clockwise and then once you have that in you're good so up here on the handle I'm gonna clip it in there and it fits right there so that's how that goes and then the attachment piece you can either leave it off or put it wherever you want or you can clip it in here as you can see or you can leave it off but most likely going to leave it off so for your card when you're not using it you have again other attachment so you just wind it around like so and that's basically how you put the vacuum together and then of course you know you plug it in when you're ready over here you have your lever to release it so once you press this down the vacuum will pivot so you can angle it wherever you want and then of course you have your power button as you can see good everything is working I would say they working brand new what do you mean so make sure you screw you screw them down tight but not too tight just snug tight and then you have a good vacuum can fit in some small closets I gonna say it's not too big not too small but to get the job done um, since me use it yesterday is is very powerful I would definitely recommend the product um, I get it from Walmart as I say cash back um, for 50 about about sixty dollar when it come up tax so I would definitely make recommend it Bissell always make a good product I actually have a steam cleaner from Bissell as well so definitely check it out if you're in the market for a new vacuum I want to make sure to keep the house clean because I tell her sometimes you go in a people house and you can't even take off your shoes because as soon as you take off your shoes something drinking on the bottom of your foot and you have to wonder what then you can't so dirty sometimes and look like in a vacuum in about 3-5 years is not cute people keep up on the place I understand oh